give up on trying to save us. I hope we come up with a fail-safe plot to piss off the dumb few that forgave us. I hope the fences we mended fall down beneath their own weight. And I hope we hang on past the last exit. I hope it's already too late. And I hope the junkyard a few blocks from here someday burns down. See you in two days. Up and at a moral. Those animals aren't going to shoot and mount their own heads themselves. Okay, Dad. And men only bring what they need. Okay, don't need this, or this, or definitely this. But... Now what's this? Oh, that's my favorite lucky shirt. Puppet Posebule, this is Blaberta Puppington. Don't hang up. Remember a few months ago when you and your family were over for dinner? I think we may have accidentally switched babies, and I'd like to switch back for sentimental reasons. You liked me once. What happened? I needed to get closer. To me? <laughs> no. To him? I'm sorry. Oh, wait. No, I'm not. I don't care. Wow. What a freeing thought. <laughs> Liberta, what brings Reverend, you? Reverend, I want you. Uh, I, uh, I'm sorry. I need you. I have this feeling. Oh well, uh, meet me at the church repression. No, uh, I want to be with you. I want your mind, your body. Oh I want to get close to you oh, in any uh, way, mm. touch you anywhere. Oh, I'm yours. Me. All yours. I'm done. What? I'm done. Go away. Go a million miles away. It's just my name! Hello, Mr. Nohammer. Oh, please, Mrs. Puppington, call me Don. I'm sorry, Don. Haven't seen you in a while. What can I do for you? Could you refresh my memory? The aisle with all the uh, cylindrical... Yeah, 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 up and in. Oh, right. <laughs> no hammers hardware. Yes, we have hammers. <laughs> no, it's just my name! Some injury, Mrs. Puppington. Mm, it's bad. Bad? Oh, no, 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 no. Not bad at all. Oh, it, it seems bad. Well, bad is relative. You see, I became a doctor because blood and injuries don't affect me the way they do most normal people. Mm. 
<laughs> the good Lord gave me the gift of not being disgusted by horrible lacerations or avulsions. <laughs> Quite the contrary. Lucky. Mm. So, do I need stitches? No! <laughs> no, no. Not on your dainty little life. Here, <clears throat> I'm prescribing you 80 milligrams of Incensitab. Take two pills every six hours or whatever. What do they do? Well, they're just a high-level painkiller that'll simply repress those nagging warning signs you get when your body desperately vies for your attention. Hmm, <laughs> nice. Just, uh, keep on doing whatever it is you're doing. Don't change your habits in the name of health or any other New Agey claptrap. Hmm, okay. And when the pills cease to have any effect, just come in and I'll take a good hard look. Then I'll raise the dosage. Ah, oh, you sure do take good care of me, Doctor. My pleasure, Mrs. Puffington. You've got a wonderfully sensitive body there, but it can take a lot of abuse. <laughs> Call me Bliberta. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There's that word again. It really hurts, Doctor. Mm -hmm. Describe your pain. Please. Uh, <clears throat> please. Well, <laughs> this is steady throbbing pain. Uh, pulsating through my whole lower body. Uh, it burns intensely uh, as it creeps uh, down from my hips, shooting ever so slow. Oh. Doctor? Dr. Potter's wheel? Uh, <clears throat> well, you seem to be doing nicely. Let's up that prescription, shall we? Quentin Xavier. I don't understand. There's no change from this morning. Why are you back here showing me this? I'm showing you because you've cured me, Doctor. Oh? I don't need to use that horrible apparatus anymore. Really? Then what do you use? You. I, I thought of you. That's all it took. Oh. Well, then you can go. Go? Yeah, sure, fine then. Just pay Nurse Bendy on the way out. You don't even care about me. <laughs> well, I care for you. <laughs> I'm a doctor. But I thought that you really... Mrs. Puffington, you'll be fine. I think you're just a little stressed out from the injury. <laughs> you can't even bear to look at me. Excuse me. I need to help my other patients now. Yes. Clay Puffington. Put him on. Yes, Clay, what can I do for you? Oral. Well, who shot him? Oh, I had a few too many highballs, eh? Well, bring him in and I'll discreetly treat the boy. You better go. I hope I cut myself shaving tomorrow. I hope it bleeds all day long. Our friends say it's darkest before the sun rises. We're pretty sure they're all wrong. Yummy. I hope it stays dark forever. I hope Ooh, the worst isn't yeah. over. And I hope you blink before I die. Yay, birdie! And I hope I never get sober. And I hope when you think of me years down the line, you can't find one good thing to say. And I'd hope that if I found the strength.
going to walk out. You'd stay the hell out Why of my way. Why did you marry Dad? Oh, well. <laughs> Why not? Well, it's just that w when he drinks, he changes. Oh, he doesn't change, Oral. That's just his true nature coming out. <laughs> I am drowning. There is no sign of land. You are coming down with me. Hand in unlovable hand, and I hope you die. I hope we both die. 